Hello, Steamians! Welcome to the shed. I'm Bucky Dirtle. I'm having some coffee and playing some music and reading some poetry. Um, when I first came to Steam it a long time ago, I, the first person I ever worked with that I ever collaborated with really was John Geddes. Um, John J. Geddes. Now, John J. Geddes is a, a writer, fantastic writer, from Canada, and um, I was nervous as a cat trying to decide what I could do to to work with John. And I um, I did an interpretation on a on a poem by him a uh, long long time ago, and uh, he was so kind to get back to me that he appreciated the the music that I that I'd done for his poem, and uh, we've co we've 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 communicated back and forth many 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 times since. So uh, I really appreciate his support from the get go. Now uh, I continue to read and sometimes play along with uh, John's work. And you should too. He's a really super writer. Um, so today I'm working on a, a poem by him, uh, which is called Blue Faced Lover. Now, a lot of things come to mind when I when I read this poem. There's a uh, um, an ocean theme to it um, or water theme. Um, and of course, blue is there as well. So it brings some things to mind. And I'm not going to tell you what, what I'm thinking. I'm going to play it. Um, and then you can take with it what you want. Uh, but I really love this, and um, um, I really love working on John J. Getty's poetry and his writings, his stories and things are really good, so you should make sure you check it out. It's fantastic. Okay, here we go. This is my interpretation of Blue Face Lover by John J. Getty's. There you go, Blue Faced Lover by John J. Geddes. I'm not going to tell you where my mind is on this one as I was playing that because I, I did a, a lot of thinking about how what this means to me from my repertoire of music, playing orchestrally and folk music and all this kind of stuff, and then what the poem means to me and what the references are. So I, I, I really enjoyed this one. I got to say, so John, thank you for this wonderful poem. And if you haven't read John's work, be sure to go to his blog and check it out. He's a really, really great writer and great steamian. So thank you very much, everybody, for listening, and I'll see you next time.